Hey there, Pisces. What's up? What's good? What's happening? Welcome in. Welcome back. This is going to be a general message for Pisces, the cross watcher, anybody that was drawn here. Take what fits, leave what doesn't. If none of this hits home, try a different message. I got a cat hair. <laughs> I'm going to do a Celtic cross spread. This is the Everyday Witch Tarot. Let's see what comes up. First thing is first, I am seeing 3553. I got to make room on my phone. I've only got that much time left to record, which is plenty. But 3553, we've got mirrored numbers and they both break into an eight. So there could have been something around the 88 Lionsgate portal that is significant to you right here, right now for this reading, okay? Or in regards to this reading. Current energy is the Emperor and the Nine of Swords. Someone is facing their fear. Somebody here that I'm talking to is facing their fears. You're overcoming your fears. You're working through your fears. You said, no, nah, I'm in control. This is my life. This is my reality. If I'm the author, how's this next chapter going to go? Okay. I'm hearing plot twist. It gets better. Talk about a plot twist. I was just shuffling upside down. But look who wound up at the bottom. Strength, courage, bravery, Leo energy. We ain't here to play no games is what I just heard. We ain't here to play games. What is incoming for Pisces? Oh, I just got, I got the butterflies. I actually felt butterflies there. You know, what's incoming for Pisces? Something good. Tell you what, the Ace of Cups, the Butterflies, and the Four of Wands. Wow. So what I'm getting is that this news is so big. People are so freaking happy for you. I'm, I'm getting the feeling that whatever fear it is that you're overcoming, most people don't. Most people stay scared of this like forever. Some of you are coming out of PTSD. Like what? How? Do share. <laughs> Please write a book because I will I will personally buy it and recommend it. Um, what? What's in the foundation here? Ace of Cups and the Four of Wands. Yeah, yeah, that's how you overcome a fear. My goodness. Foundation for Pisces. Did I say Aries, Taurus, Divine, Masculine, Mars? The Ace of Pentacles. There's a really weird sound. It sounds like a fly stuck in some kind of a tube. <laughs> you know those, um, the rain maker? Uh, it's like a plastic tube and it's got all the little beads. You flip it up, right? And all the beads fall down and it makes the sound of rain. And then you flip it and then the beads fall again. And then you flip it and it just keeps back and forth. It sounds like a fly is stuck in one of those tubes. Very weird. Ace of Pentacles in the foundation. This is your seed, the seeds that you're planting. This is that new, I ain't scared anymore. I feel like this is an award. I, I feel like this is an accomplishment. Something that you have. I'm also hearing gold, golden children. Oh no, that's not a page. That's an ace. You could be a golden child though, but, um, or indigo children, rainbow children. Interesting. What else came out for the recent past is the five of cups, but it's in the reverse. So you're no longer sad about spilt milk. Okay, whatever you were scared of, whatever you had a fear of, some people may say it's an irrational fear. The fuck? No, that was definitely rational. Most people are still scared of this. Most people don't overcome this fear that you're overcoming. And I don't know what this fear is. It's going to be different for each of you. That's probably why I'm not pinpointing it. 
For some of you, it's being the leader. For some of you, it is making a, a large purchase and having to make payments. For some of you, it's opening up a business. For some of you, it's having a family. Um, I don't know, man. It could be so many different things. But whatever it is, you're not scared of this anymore. For some of you, it's your destiny. Scam likely. Fuck off my phone. Crowning you is the devil, though. Ace of Wands is at the bottom of the deck. Because that's what you're up against, is fear itself. Come on. Sorry, just all the cards keep falling. Near future is the Knight of Swords. This is you chopping that fear in half. This is a lot of messages between you and the universe. And this is you going for it, okay? Um, I've had people tell me they have something chasing them in their dreams. And I tell them, I want you to gain the courage to at some point throughout your running away, stop running away, turn around and face this fucking thing. And then do that white light where you create the white light Make the ball real nice and big and then smack it and let it just explode and clear the whole space of all negative energy. You will blast that thing into nothingness. It's essentially stardust. Some of you are going to war with a very rational fear and you're winning. You are winning. You're not going to be scared of this anymore. Two of Swords. So the blockage is going for it, taking your shot. Some of you are scared to look. I <laughs> see the blindfold. It's like, I'm scared to look. But if you did look, you got the bullseye. Do you see the way this cat is looking at the bird? Like, did you just see what they did? Look at the bird's mouth is wide open. Like, <laughs> she's going to throw that knife and split the, the one that's in the bullseye already, you know, or get it right next to it. Also in the bullseye, like that's you. What are you scared of success? That's that makes sense, though, because like, actually, I yeah. Yeah, some people are scared of success. How the universe is viewing you, we have the page, I'm sorry, the nine of cups and then the page of wands. So this is you reclaiming your happiness. You're no longer scared of that path because you've overcome it. You've conquered it. If anything, that, that path better be scared of you moving forward, you know? <laughs> the goal here is to keep your eyes on what comes next. You're having premonitions. You're seeing things before they happen. And I think, um, Pisces, your goal is to know that those ships are coming in. Some of you are calling them in because of this new vibration. You don't have that low vibrational fear thing constantly tugging at you, anchoring you down. That's been released. So now you can fly higher. You can... Um, energetically vibe higher which means you have access to greater things now i'm hearing the wind beneath my wings and i feel like there's an ancestor that's with you and you're going to know who it is because of that song what is the outcome for pisces please and thank you god Thank you. The five of pentacles in reverse. You're coming out of the cold into the warmth where life's not so bad. The grass is very green and you have less fears than you did two years ago. For some of you, five minutes ago, right? Overall, at the bottom of the deck is the seven of wands. You let these little fuckers know that they shall not pass, okay? And they won't. Stay on your defense. You are so protected. 
And by doing this, by battling your own demons, your own fears, you are your own best defense. You move accordingly and then the divine can come in and back that up. Right? They can tell you, stay away from so-and-so, stay away from so-and-so, stay away from so-and-so. As long as you stay away from so-and-so, they can keep you safe. But if you physically go back and be around so-and-so, they can't help you as much. But you're not going back. You're moving on, up, forward. They can't reach you now. I'm so fucking proud of you, Pisces. I hope everybody sees this. I really do. I hope a lot of people are drawn to this because this, this is what I'm here for right here. I'm going to leave it right here. I hope this helps who it needs to, how it needs to. I love yous and I will see you in the next one. Until then, stay beautiful.